Hi guys, I am back and sorry to disappoint some of my viewers here, but I am not Arnold Schwarzenegger. Sorry to disappoint you. Okay, what I wanted to show you today, since I'm doing my custom ROM database and it seems to work pretty nice, at least the server crashed thanks to Lifehacker, I wanted to expand it and improve it even more. And one thing I wanted to do is explain certain custom ROM features, either we are a small note, a screenshot or even videos. And this is what I'm doing now. I want to explain certain features that are worth showing off on a video. And if you like the idea in general, hit the like button or leave me a comment. So let's just get to the point of this video and start with the first feature I want to explain. It is called Gesture Anywhere. What does Gesture Anywhere do? It gives you a trigger area here and if you swipe into it, the screen dims slightly. Normally it's just a bit gray transparent, but it looks blue because of the camera. And what you can do now is just draw anything you want on the screen to launch something. Let's do a P, let's say for the Play Store, or a C for the Color Dictionary, or let's do a F for Feedly. Like you see, this works pretty easy and fast for people who like gesture type opening. So how does this work? You have a few settings here. First you can select the left or the right edge for your trigger. Then you can also change the width, the position or the height. And here are the gestures you can set up. You can set an, an infinite amount I guess. I didn't hit the limit, not even close. And what you can do now, you can add, I just added one to show it off. And now we can draw anything you want. Let's say an S. And the next time I launch the transparent sheet, I just draw an S and the app launches. It's that easy. And you can do this with practically everything. Let, like you see here, my plus, it, it launches. N for the naked browser. You can see that pretty easy. So this was my explanation of the Gesture Anywhere feature of ROMs. It was originated from the Chameleon OS. And as I said before, if you like those explanations of features in form as a video, just let me know. Okay, that's it for now. Okay, bye.